besties, I'm just at my local bookshop looking at all of these different stories and one of them is my absolute favourite and it's given me a great make idea. So let's head to the hangout and we'll get started. So let's make a rainbow fish. Everything you will need will be in the description below. So let's get started. first step to make your rainbow fish we're going to make a circle to help me draw my circle I've decided to use a bowl and I'll just place this down on the paper and then use my pencil to draw around it and there we have it a perfect circle now that you've drawn your circle we're going to cut this out with some scissors and then with our scrap pieces of paper we're going to make our fins and tail out of it. Remember Arties you always have to be careful when using scissors. Now to make our fishes scales and tails. Scales and tails that was a funny rhyme. We are going to draw three small triangles and two big triangles. I'm going to start with the small triangles first. These will go at the bottom of our fish's body. So we've got one, two, three. And now all we need is two larger ones. So we're going to do one large one here. And another large one here. And now all we need to do is cut them out and we can glue them down. So we have our circle and we have all of our triangles. Now we need a glue stick and we're just going to stick them in place and make it look a lot more like a fish. So I've put my triangles near the areas where I'm going to stick them down with the glue. And then when I'm finished, I can flip it over and then we will be able to decorate our rainbow fish. Just remember, you just need to put the glue right here when you're sticking your tile down. And then the same again, but only on the edge of this one. And now for our little fins, these are a bit smaller so it might be a little bit trickier. And now when you flip it around, it should look a lot more like a fish. All we need to do now is add a small head to make his eyes and mouth and then there'll be so much space to make our scales. To make our face, I'm going to take our bowl again, but I'm just going to put it right here so there's a small gap and then I can draw around it. And there you have it, we have a fish face. So now I can draw a small eye. Maybe a little eyebrow. And then, lips. He's starting to look a lot more like a fish now. So, I'm really sorry grown ups, but this one is going to be a messy make because he's not an ordinary fish, he's a rainbow fish. So, we're going to get super crazy with all of our paints and we're going to use all of the different colours, put our finger in it and pop, 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 pop everywhere. To put our paint out, I'm going to use a recycled egg carton, but I'm not going to fill these too high because we don't want our colours to mix. So I think I'm going to use yellow and I think now I'm going to use green, some pink, some gold, purple and some blue. Are you ready to get messy arties? Because I am. Remember to use a different finger each time because we don't want to mix it. You can put your scales wherever you like.
And now we need to wash our hands before we get to the next part. Looking at our rainbow fish, I can see here that he has some scales that has quite a metallic look to it. And this gives me an idea. Do you remember when we made our disco ball and we had all of that tin foil? Well, we still have so much left over. So I think we could use it to create our tail and our fin. And we could also add some metallic scales too. So all you need to do is after asking your grown up for some tin foil, you just get some glue, add it to the back of your tin foil and stick it on wherever you like. When it goes bumpy, just like mine has, I think it looks a lot more like the scales of a fish. And now that his tails and fins are complete, now we can make the middle even prettier by adding some tinfoil on his body. Anyway. That is a rainbow fish for sure. And there we have it, our very own rainbow fish. And from reading the story, I know that it's all about friends and sharing. So I'm going to give my rainbow fish to a close friend of mine. Who will you gift yours to? Don't forget to comment and let me know. Me and Rainbow Fish are going to go for a swim in the bathtub now. So I'll see you later, Arties. I hope you had fun with this make. Bye-bye.